Okay, today we're going to look at how to get into uh, Clever so you can use those different applications that are in Clever that your teachers may want you to use. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to either log into our Chromebook or we're going to use a computer at home. And once we're in the computer, we're going to open up the Chrome browser. Or if we're using the Chromebook, we're going to open up the Chrome browser. And we want to make sure that we're logged in with our school Google account. And in this case, I'm making sure that we are. And yes, we're in a student's Google account. All right. Now, on everyone's computer, everyone's student account, if you look up here, you'll have a little C. And that means you have access to the Clever site. So that's what you want to click on is right there. You click on that little Clever site. And now, if this is the first time you've done this on your Chromebook or the first time you've done it on the computer you're using at home, you have to tell it what school you go to. So you click in here and you just type Hamtramck. Once you've typed that, just find the school in Hamtramck that you go to. And this student, I happen to know, is a Ta Beta student. So I'm going to click right there. Now, this pops up. If you happen to have your QR code at home and you have a camera on your computer or you're using your Chromebook, you can use the QR code just like you did in class. But if not, you can still get into Clever, so don't be concerned. We're going to log in using Active Directory. We are not going to log in using Clever. We're going to log in using Active Directory. So I'm going to click right there in Active Directory. and It'll take us up to a screen that looks something like this. And in here, you're going to need to type in your 700 number again. So I'm going to go ahead and type in the 700 number. Then you have to put the at sign. You're a student, so put students, S-T-U-D-E-N-T-S dot Hamtramckschools dot org. And then in the password, you put that same password that you've been using all the time at school. That's your birth date. It's the eight-digit birth date. It doesn't have any slashes, and it's eight digits. So if you were born in June, that's 06. If you were born on June 5th, that's 0605. So put in your birth date. And you hit enter and you're all set. Now you can do whatever your teachers asked you to do in the past in Clever. It's that simple. So thank you for paying.